He doesn't know it. Oh, we won. We won a game. We won a game. Wow. Wow, we won a game. I'm telling you, this team is overpowered. What is going on today guys, AU here, and today we're bringing you probably the best team I've ever made, and um, it's a little interesting. I'm going to say you probably won't be able to win today without using this team. Now there's a big reason for it, if you know the reason, let me know, but I'm not going to tell you the reason because I mean you got you to figure it out, and this team, like I'm telling you, there's no other way to win today. On the day that you're seeing this video, there's no other way to win unless you use this team. Now. I'm gonna say I'm playing the day before so if I do lose a couple games it's because I'm not playing on the day that you'll actually be playing with this team um so don't if I lose don't take don't, I haven't lost yet with this team I'm gonna I, I haven't lost yet um I am undefeated with this team but if I do lose um it's because I'm not playing with it on the right day now I do want to say if you are new here subscribe because I'm posting Pokemon videos like this every single day um, we got competitive Pokemon pretty much every week, and I'm actually starting to kind of branch off into a little, a little more stuff. But um, anyways, so if you are new here, subscribe, and uh, you'll be able to see videos like this every single day. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and say I, I really don't want to break this team down because I don't want to like give, give all the um, the secret text behind this team. But we are here. We have our GMAX Grimmsnarl with our weakness policy. Um, prankster ability with fake out spirit break sucker punch and superpower um, he's like a big heavy hitter uh, pretty pretty much he carries he carries a team I am running adamant I thought about running jolly but I do want to see what speed that hits it's 123 I actually think I'll probably run jolly on him I got a live part here with a jet button uh, prankster uh, with trick foul play screech and thunder wave um, uh, I mean it, it's pretty much it pairs really well with uh, Grimstar with screech uh, foul play and thunder wave helps with speed control we also have our Wimscott here with Focus Sash, Abilities Prankster. Um, we have Tailwind, Taunt, Protect, and Moonblast, another another good way of speed control. Um, taunt like to help with like other to other Whimsicott or Trick Room Setters or stuff like that. We have Riolu here with EV Light, Ability is Prankster. Uh, we have Bullet Punch, Helping Hand, Howl, and Final Gambit. This pairs really well beside Grim Snarl. We can get a Howl off and get plus one attack. We can even get a Bullet Punch off and Prophet Sweetness Policy. And we have Meowstic here with Light Clay, Ability Prankster. Uh, we have Thunder Wave, Light Screen, Psychic, and Reflect. Um, just max HP, max defense with some into special defense. We have Sableye here with the Roselli Berry, with Prankster, with Bake Out Ally Switch, Fal or Quashin and Foul Play. And it's the same same EVs I use on my on my other Sableyes. So I'm not gonna, like I said, I'm not gonna really give you the uh, the text behind this team a lot. I'm not gonna go into too much more depth with it. We're just gonna jump into some battles and. Uh, like I said, I haven't lost yet, so so we're gonna see if that can even happen. All right, and we're paired up with like a pretty hyper offense team. Um, that Charizard might be a little annoying to deal with, but we should be able to um, to deal with it pretty easily. Um, which one of these things has fake out? I can lead with Sableye. And Grimmsnarl. I can leave Riolu and Grimmsnarl. Um, let's see, I think I'm gonna lead I'm gonna leave Grimmsnarl and Riolu. And I'll have Sableye in the back along with my. Uh, actually, let's do this. Let's lead Lipard Ri Riolu. I'm gonna have Grimmsnarl and Sableye in the back. Yeah, alright, so they go with a uh, Wimscott and Charizard. Now I'm going to assume that they're going to max the Charizard. I'm just going to trick and I'm going to bullet punch into that Charizard. And we'll see what he does. So he does max the Charizard. Uh, we're going to get this trick off. He goes for the Tailwind, but that doesn't matter because we are using priority moves. Uh, and that Charizard's going to have to gonna have to leave. Um, we don't want the Charizard in. And we get rid of this max just like that. Um, so that's pretty much the reason I, I dealt with this or I led with this way um, now here here I'm actually gonna screech this whimsicott and I'm gonna bullet punch this whimsicott I'm assuming that it is uh, focus sash but we'll see I that actually did nothing <laughs> that actually did zero uh, damage to that whimsicott even after the screech he does flash can our life orb uh, he's life orb uh, Duraludon so I'm gonna go into Grimmsnarl here and I'm actually gonna screech 
Actually, do I want to? Um, let's see. Who do I think he's going to? He's going to attack here. I'm assuming this one's guy's just going to moonblast in my Grimmsnarl, and he's going to try to hit. Uh, he might flash cannon. Yeah, he probably is actually going to flash cannon Grimmsnarl. I'm going to screech here, and I'm going to sucker punch uh, that Duraludon. I actually didn't kill. I'm a little bit surprised, but that's okay. Oh, flash cannon took us out. <laughs> well, <laughs> there with there with the first game. Um, I actually wish he would have. Um, he would have killed the live part there. Yeah. <laughs> um. Okay. That that game doesn't count. I'm gonna go into another one. All right. All right. Um. So. We don't we don't have a horrible matchup here actually. Um, man, I wish I could hit something other than with just Grimmsnarl. Grimmsnarl is the only way I can hit anything. Um, so I'm actually gonna go with Bunzakot and Grimmsnarl as the lead. I think I have Riolu in the back, um, and probably. Uh, Probably the live hard, maybe. I don't know. I don't have any. I don't have any other way to hit. Like I can't hit that Corviknight at all. All right, so it goes. It goes with Grimsaw and Rotom. Um, I'm just gonna max here, and I'm gonna max Starfall the uh, Grimsaw. And I'm actually gonna. I can't taunt. Dang it. Um, I'm gonna tell one. I guess. <laughs> I can't taunt the Grimsaw. If he gets up like a reflect, then we might be in trouble. Hopefully he doesn't reflect. And hopefully he's not Roselli Berry. Oh, he tricked. Oh, but we're immune. He doesn't know it. He doesn't know it. Oh, we won. We won a game. We won a game. Wow. Wow, we won a game. I'm telling you, this team is overpowered. We actually, like, we actually just demolished him. I'm actually... I'm, I'm not surprised we won a game. It's like the team's too powerful, honestly. I'm just gonna jump right into another one. Like I don't think anybody we we fight today is gonna stand a chance against against this team. All right, see here, like we can deal with this. It's um, for some reason they've got Frostmoth and they got Colossal and uh, Excadrill. They probably have like Surf on that Dragapult. Um, so that means that I can lead Lipard and Riolu, and I'm just gonna go in with Grim Snarl on the back. And I'm actually gonna have Save the Lie in the back too. I actually think we can win this one. Um, assuming that they go with Colossal and Dragon Pull up front, I'm just gonna trick and uh, bullet punch that Colossal. The only thing is the Excadrill might give us a hard time, but if we max our Grim Snarl, then uh, we shouldn't have a horrible time with it. So it does go Colossal and Dragon Pull. That's great. Um, we are just gonna trick. And bullet punch that colossal. I'm assuming he has no idea what's going on, but yep, the exact, he's gonna dynamax that colossal. Um, we get the trick off. We're gonna get this bullet punch off. But we get colossal out of here, which means he's gonna serve something that comes in. So if he has to bring an excadrill here, then we break a potential sash on the excadrill. But I'm assuming the sash is on the dragon pole. All right, so it goes in the frost mod. Um. So he crits Riolu, and here I'm gonna Thunder Wave that Dragapult, and I'm gonna Bullet Punch this Frostmoth because it's uh, four times. No, is it four times? I don't remember if, if Bug is like. No, no, no. Steel's not super effective against Bug, but it is some kind of effective on that Frostmoth. So let's see what, what he does. <laughs> I'm actually I'm actually surprised he didn't just quit. <laughs> Alright, so we get the bullet punch off and we do like 7 damage. Um, and he's gonna Phantom Force the Dragon Pult, which is okay. Um, now we can just go into Grim Snarl here. And I'm going to max. And I'm going to Starfall. And I'm also gonna. Ooh, I'm gonna bullet punch actually. I'm gonna bullet punch my Grim Snarl. Alright, so we get the bullet punch off. We'll see what he goes for. 
All right, we are faster than the Frost mod, so we get that. Oh, and the Dragon Bolt got fully paired. I think we're actually gonna win this game. Um, so he does come in with an Intimidate, but that's fine. I'm just gonna, um, let's see. I wanna, uh, do I? No. I'm gonna Starfall again that, on that Gyarados, and I'm actually gonna Howl and raise my attack. So we get the Howl off. Uh, he waterfalls. We're gonna take out the Gyarados here. We know that Colossal is the last Pokemon he has, and he goes for U-turn. So we're actually gonna be able to just Howl again and Max Knuckle that Colossal. Do I even need to Howl? So we're faster than Dragapult here, so we don't have to worry about the Colossal. Um, let's see, this is this is 120 times 1 1.5, so that's 180, and this is going to be 190. So yeah, this Max Knuckle is going to do more. And honestly, I think I'm just going to Howl again. Um, let's see, if he protects Colossal here, then wait, now that still wouldn't be that wouldn't be bad for us. Um, so get this Max Knuckle off, and we take out Colossal. And Grimstar is actually going to sweep his whole team. Wow, this is oh, he got paralyzed again. So here I'm just going to Sucker Punch. I'm going to Bullet Punch. I actually am. <laughs> I was so surprised that we won this game. Um, I actually don't even have to Sucker Punch. I can just Spirit Break and Bullet Punch. That's insane. That's actually insane. <laughs> Alright guys, so there you have it. That's the team. Like I'm telling you, you can't, you pretty much can't lose with this team. Like that first game was a complete hoax. You pretty much cannot lose with this team. Um, so definitely check it out if you want to have some fun. And happy, happy April Fools guys. If you like what you saw, like, like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch you guys on the next one. See ya.